What's up, guys? Happy July 4th to those who celebrate in the U.S. I, myself, am going to a barbecue. Hopefully, you get a little tanner uh, this <laughs> on this day. But before I did that, I had my coffee here, and I posted a DCA buy alert. I bought around 60K more Caspa. Yes, I am buying more Caspa. Anytime I see crashes, I notice many micro caps do not uh, go down as much. They usually stay close to where they were because there's not many holders to begin with. Some of them do crash. Of course, I see a bunch of memes and everything crashing. But in 2022, I did the same thing where I look to also buy the blue chips or the stability plays at a cheaper price. Now, I've been very active this week buying a lot of cryptos. Those in my Discord know this. But Caspa at a $4 billion market cap below $0.17, cents, I think I bought at 16.4 or something like that, was a steal. And by the way, if you're from the U.S., I recommend buying Caspa on Uphold. Uphold's a very safe, it's a regulated exchange. They have it there. You can buy it. You can send it off to cold storage, whether it's Tangem or whatever wallet well, supports it that you like. One key. Um, Uphold's been an exchange I've been using now for over a couple years, and I had no issues with it. The only thing I don't like is they have a limit on how much you can buy and withdraw. So that's why I recommend cold storage or whatever you're cool with. And by the way, if you want to reach out to me, talk to me. Send so crypto on buy, sell, and trade. Next, be part of private live streams where we do Q&As every single week. Be the next financially free investor, which we have over 40 who have already made six to seven figures already. I encourage you to join Patreon and Discord. We're running a 40% discount. It is ending today, probably. I think we had like seven or eight spots left for Shark and about 12 or 13 for Whale last I checked. Once they sell out, it is done and it's going up 40%. If you want to catch this discount, then I encourage you to join Patreon and Discord. I'll leave a link in the pink comments down below. But Cash Book, I haven't finished because I've been very busy, but I've been watching a lot of AMAs. Shay, who's one of the core developers for Cash Book, has been talking to everybody, it seems, on YouTube. And this guy is very authentic, very chill and methodical. And he's just an all-around great guy from what I've seen so far. And uh, the team is just very, like, pr uh, working towards progress, I noticed. The reason why Caspa didn't break 20 cents in the past couple weeks is because they had a issue on launching Casplex, which is okay. People had an overreaction. They're like, oh, it's doomed. It's going to failure, right? Um... This is the thing of later ones, right? Later ones are always forward moving. They always take time. They're all meant for longevity. So Ethereum, for those who don't know, also has a roadmap. And they failed many times to try to migrate effectively. They had some issues and they just, you know, fixed it and eventually became Ethereum 2.0 that we see today. Solana, the network goes down oftentimes from bots and bad actors and they had to fix it and they've been better since. So Casper having this issue is not even an issue in my eyes. It's just a bump on the hurdle to progress, no? innovation. And Casper to me, I mean, I've been buying this at, as low as a penny, you know, lowest entry, and as high as the all-time high. This just goes to show you how convicted I am in this play. Now, in terms of how much 50k Casper can be in 2025 or next year, if that is indeed the peak of the bull cycle, I... See Casper still going around this two dollar range. I said one to like three. I say two dollars, maybe three. I know it's very conservative if you watch other people who, who say it's going to ten plus dollars. You can believe what you want to believe. I am more conservative. I've always been, and I'm still extremely bullish on Casper. I just think it's going to be a little bit of a hurdle to get to that three to five dollar range. Or more if they don't get every tier one exchange. If they get everything, including Coinbase, we very well could hit five dollars. So I'm going to include five dollars in this prediction. So it's going to be a very broad range of two to five dollars. That means your you know 50k cash, but can be worth anywhere from 100k to 250k. And before you say, well, it's not a lot of money in stocks. To two x your ten thousand dollars would take you an average ten years. If you're investing in the S&P 500, which is the top 500 companies, a 2x in 10 years in stocks or a 10x here, which is a little shy of $2, 0.17 times 30 is $5. Okay, so a 10 to 30x from here, 
in potentially one year versus a 2x in 10 years in stocks. Layer 1s are not mean coins. So layer 1s, they scale nicely. That's why many people, including myself, see them as store values. And again, the reason why Caspa barely dips is because it's fair launch. A lot of people believe in what they're holding. They're starting to. The community is growing, although I'm not a huge fan of the maxis, but it is growing in the right direction. And now that they announced, you know, KRC20s, Caspex, you can mint coins. And the fact that it's going to have a first bull cycle and the team is just now doing AMAs a lot more. I see a very bull's future for Caspa, both in the short term and the long term. And at some point, it's already in the top, you no know, 20s in terms of coin market cap. It's going to break the teens. I said in my last video for Caspa, do not be surprised. And when it does, I will also not be surprised that a tier one exchange or many will list Caspa. I'm telling you guys, you can say, go screw this guy. Who cares what he says? Who cares what he thinks? 17 cent Caspa, maybe expected to you. But for me, it is worth the DCA. And I think this is going to make people a lot of money in the near future. But anyways, I want to hear from you. Are you still buying Caspa at 17 cents? And where do you see its price by the end of this cycle? Drop your comment down below and let me know. If you enjoyed this video, please give a like. It really helps so much that being said. I hope you have a great day and I'll see you next time.